Santa Cruz is on the spot. So we're just looking at options. If it would be possible to move up, I know you have 19 and 46, right? The whole purpose of this draft is to try to find some guys who can come in and, and make training camp more competitive, make our team more competitive, and just continue to expand on the culture that we're putting together here in Santa Cruz. Once we have the board of the best available players in the draft, then we reevaluate when our pick comes. First and foremost, I mean, I think it's a character thing. You know, the organization, we look for high character guys. Our staff did a great job of, of scouting the entire draft. The synergy that's great about our situation is Kent's been up with us. He understands kind of how we do our draft. I thought Kent's biggest strength was he listened to what each of the guys had to say. He was comfortable with the, the order that they had and all the work that his guys did behind the scenes to trust them to say, okay, when it came down to pick in 66, the staff all collaborated well and I think they got the guys they wanted. The Santa Cruz Warriors are ready to select with the 14th pick in the third round. With the 8th pick of the fourth round, with the uh, 27th pick of the fourth round, Santa Cruz Warriors select Avery Holmes, Nigel Young. The Santa Cruz Warriors select Malik Story. Santa Cruz select Avery Holmes is confirmed. I'm with Kelly and on the clock. It's hard to know while it's still on paper, but uh, we're really excited to get the season started and can't wait for when we start playing basketball. We're going to come in there intense as a coaching staff. Uh, we want them to compete, be competitive. That's the biggest thing. You know, we're not worried about mistakes because that's going to happen. But as long as you make mistakes going hard, we can live with it. Work on three. One, two, three. Work. Work.